Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import about 2 million AI generated faces into your character creator for CC4 through the Headshot plugin for character creator. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, you can just scroll down, go to my video descriptions, enter the first link. For the first link is AI generated faces. All right. So you, you get in, click into the first link, and then it will show you a web page at here. Wait, this one. Okay, this is the, the free AI generated photos. And what you are going to do is just go and find a photo. For example, so now, the head pose you must choose front facing. And then you, ch you choose a gender. For example, I choose female. And then the age, I choose young adult. For example, you have the middle age, you have the baby, you have the infants, young adult, for example. And then the ethnic the ethnic city, maybe I want to choose the white. And then the eyes color, I may choose blue, for example, the hair color. I may choose brown. Then emotions, you must choose neutral. For example, you already filter it out and then click apply. It will filter out the result that you want. For example, for this time, I only want to choose the brown. Okay, so now I'm, I'm going to choose once. Let's say, let's say this one. Right, I can just right click, save the image as. As demo, I'm going to save it on my desktop. And this is a JPG image. And next. Next, we are going to get the character creator for and also get the headshot plugin. Once you, you get ready, you can open your character creator for. Character creator for. All right, now you can see the CC4 is ready, Character Creator 4. Now, what you are going to do is just go and click the headshot. This is the headshot plugin, choose the auto. And then from the desktop, just now you already have the JPG picture. Just need to drag in into here. And then for, for this case, I'm going to choose female, clean solve. And I will click generate. Once you click generate here, you just need to wait for a few seconds here. It is analyzing and just wait for a while first. Now you can see it is done. It automatically generate a 3D avatar for you. And now you can create your own 3D avatar. And next I'm going to content. And I will go to the shirt. I choose item. I choose the cloth shirt to give this avatar a shirt. Let's say I give this shirt. And next, I'm going to give this avatar a skirt or pants. Just choose one. For example, here I have a pink, pink skirt or I will just give her short pants here. Double click it, it will automatically apply. Next, I will give her a shoes. Shoes from here. Sports sneakers. A5. Now you can see everything already applied properly. And then what, what you can do now, if you want to, be, to view in T-Pose, you can just click here. The animations, the pose, the calibration. All right. This is the T-Pose. And then and here you can just export it out, file export as FBX file. Or you can just 
Export it as iAvatar for your Icon 8 3D animation software. Or you can direct send it to Icon. And to, or you can just, add, just save the project as a CC avatar, a CC project so that you can edit it next time. Alright, that's all for today about how to import about 2 million of the AI generated the AI generated faces into Character Creator for CC4 through the Headshot plugin and make it become one of the, the 3D avatar in your 3D animation software, export it as FBX or the I avatar in your iClone 8. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you'll receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy animation and game developing. See you.